Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to share you how to go to the UEFI firmware settings in the Windows 10 OS. So this is the Windows 10 based operating system. So let's see how to do that. Now, first of all, just click on the start menu and after that, go to the settings option. So in the settings option, just go to the update and security. So just double click that and here just go to the option recovery. So and after that, here is the option advanced startup. So you have to click on that. So currently it need to be restart up. So in case if you are already having some other work means just save all the work. And in case if you are already having some of the apps open means close all the things. And after that just click on the restart now option so now the system is actually restarted and go to the recovery option so just wait a minute so now you'll get actually some of these options so here you want to choose the option called troubleshoot and after that here just click on the advanced options and here is the option called UEFI firmware settings just click on that so in the Windows 10 only you will get a like this uh, different setting option for Windows 11 the setting option will actually differ and after that just click on the restart now the system will be restarted with the UEFI firmware setting page so it's actually takes some time so be patient and now that's it so this is how you can easily able to go to the UEFI firmware settings in your Windows 10 based laptops you can easily do that while the system in the on condition itself and during off condition you also you can able to do that just to restart the PC and during restarting and, and while booting up you have to press the F8 key and the keys will be actually diverse for some laptops or it's actually based on the uh, manufacturer so based on the manufacturer the key will be diverse for some brands it will be F2 or F10 like that well now that's it for today video and hopefully if you guys like this video hit the like button and if you guys like to watch my upcoming videos hit the subscribe button below and thanks for watching this video guys.